Right, the first thing to do in a new car, air freshener. Thanks to the guys at Car Cologne. They know what I like and have sent me Velvet Oud for this car. I'm a really big fan of new car smells. Who is? So the first thing we're gonna do is get this in. Wow, that smells amazing. Right, that's better. Right, let's go. Let's go for a little drive and see what this car's like. So, this is the new M440i, AKA the Fall. Let's go and check out what it's like. the elephant in the room or on the grill in a minute um, this is a three litre 375 horsepower four series four wheel drive in an individual drive it gray or drive it gray whichever you look at it now the pictures that you'll see now won't do it any justice I'll tell you now because the Sun's been out today and it has a, has a bit of a sparkle to it it's a nice little mix in there it looks fantastic so if you've ordered this car without seeing it you will love it. It's going to look fantastic in the sunshine. Um, this particular car has pretty much every single pack on it, visibility pack with those uh, with those lights. It has the M technology pack. It has the normal tech pack. It has the M Plus Pro pack. It has all sorts of packs. Um, inside, we've got black leather, blue stitching. Sorry. Personally, I would have preferred you know, red. They do a nice red in this. Um, or even it's like a Silverstone, which is available in like the M3s and M4, current M4s. Uh, let's talk about the outside. Come on, everyone wants to talk about it. The grill. What I think has happened is the photographers at BMW Press take pictures in a way where it makes the grill look really really shockingly bad but actually it's not I think it actually suits the car when you're up close and personal with it genuinely I'm not, I'm not messing around or anything I actually do think it doesn't look too bad I think they, they, as I said the, the press pictures that came out made it look awful and everyone's going oh my god what have they done what is that face on that car get it in the right colour I think you're fine this is obviously the M440i, so you know you, you have that extra added kind of bronze around it, but it looks all right. It's not, it's not, it's not as bad as I thought. Um, so take that away, you know, it looks fine, right? Let's look at the rest of the car. It actually feels bigger than it looks. Um, you know, driving it, it actually feels a lot bigger. Considering it's a two-door coupe, it, it feels great. It's like a proper maybe not a proper GT car but you know you could go and do a thousand miles on it if you want to go and do a thousand miles on it technology in this car is, is yeah it's right up there I, th I, but I think and I haven't had this confirmed so please don't hold me to this I think this is one step away or one click away from being complete autonomous I use the adaptive cruise control the other day and I had a display similar to what I've seen in some Teslas where it shows all the cars around you uh, which is which is fantastic, you know. It, you can't really can't really say anything about that. It's, it's, it works around town. It's a good, comfortable car, good, comfortable drive. The new technology that you expect from things like the new three series, the new five series, the X5 and the X7 is all come down in this car. This new trim in the car. I don't know what it's called, but it actually looks alright. It's like a I thought it was carbon fibre at first, but it's not. It's it's an aluminium kind of gloss finish on it. it handles the road really, really well, really well. But listen, back to this four series. Drives really well, 
handles the road really well, goes around corners really well. Um, negatives. Um, price. Definitely the price. This this particular car, brand new, ordered. Are you ready? Sixty five thousand pounds just shy of sixty five thousand pounds um, i'm sure there's some deals to be had partridge will will do you a deal so you won't pay sixty five grand for it um but i mean it's it just works it, re it really genuinely does work it's not i'm not going to say it just for the sake of it this goes against i think things like c43s and um audi s5s and yeah yeah you you can you can enjoy this car you know, it's not, suspension's not that hard, it's comfortable, works. One thing I love about BMWs is the way their seats just hug you. Wow. Um, you go around those corners and, you know, these, these elements here just, just hold you in place. function on, on the side but it's so good where you can just tighten it up and just hold you in place obviously we haven't got too many bendy roads here in, in west london but really really comfortable car really good car so this car was supplied to me by partridge bmw so thank you to partridge um you'll see a lot more on them very very soon i have now partnered with them on on bmw uh, product so you'll see as I said you'll see a lot more on them on Instagram on on uh, on, on YouTube um, and obviously car cologne velvet oud um, which I'm hoping the camera picks it up if not it's uh, so there. oops um, you're getting into a new car you don't you don't always want that new car smell car cologne sort you out go and check them out on Instagram I'll leave the link in the in the uh, in the description these guys have, uh, have hooked me right up so thank you to those boys guys as always thank you very much for watching what I do want to say is we are about to go into a second lockdown here in England stay safe and uh, I'll try and keep kicking out some videos for you guys to enjoy give me a thumbs up let me know what you think of the video in the comments below because uh, I'm always eager to know and let me know about the grill you know listen I'm not going to touch on it too much because I actually think it looks all right um, the car's fantastic it drives really really well if you've ordered one of these you will not be disappointed absolutely not it's a great engine very very comfortable very spacious the boots decent as well um, I was quite surprised how good uh, I think this one's got split fold seats as well but overall it's a really really good car um, new C-Class is out next year it'll be interesting to see how they elevate that it's, it's a decent car and, and I think Audi have just done the A5 recently so all in all it's a great bit of comfort this handles the road well it drives well it needs a louder exhaust but I say that about everything nowadays the, the, the European laws have, have changed that and we're going to have that as a big problem um, but overall it's, it's fantastic as always thank you so much for watching let me know what you think of the video in the comment section below and uh, give it a thumbs up i'll see you soon bye for now